Uh, hi, we're DJI. We make uh, aerial cinema for uh, consumers, uh, prosumers, and the uh, professionals, uh, photographers, and cinema, uh, videographers. What I have with me in my hand is the Phantom Vision Plus. It's the latest product from our uh, Phantom series, 14 megapixel camera, uh, three axis gimbal to uh, stabilize the yaw. Um, the camera itself is smaller than the old version that we have. Flight time is 25 minutes, very smooth, very stable. Um, just announced two days ago at NAB. Uh, comparatively, the Phantom 2, which is with the H Zenmuse H3 3D gimbal, uh, same technology in terms of the yaw, uh, stabilizing the yaw, uh, tilt again as well with the GoPro. Uh, so we can compare it side by side and you can see the difference that we have in terms of the camera, in terms of the technology, and both actually uh, provide that stability that you see there. Our company um, have also been making another product named the Phantom Vision. And this is the first version of the Vision. And you can see the difference between the first and the second one. And that is in terms of the uh, gimbal itself. So the Phantom Vision, Phantom 2 Vision itself, is only two axes. Actually, it goes up and down, and you turn left and right. We improved on it with the Phantom 2 Vision Plus by giving the camera the three axes so it's more for video, uh, allowing for that smooth, stable uh, footage that everyone craves. It is still 1080p, so it's high definition. Uh, and the download, again, it is a raw file. You can download with the SD card. And we give an SD card out, we can put that in back right in, and you can download that and edit it in Adobe Creative Suite as well. Uh, we also make uh, the professional version. So what we have here is the SA function Evo. Now depending on the camera load, um, this is a hex rotor. This takes uh, from anything from a Sony X7 to a GH3 and 4. Um, and you're looking at a flight time of about 10 to 15 minutes. Um, you have the ASO control there, uh, you, can, you can do waypoints around as well. Uh, but the, good, the better one we have is the S1000. Now, we come over this way. The S1000 itself is a big octo rotor. And the octo rotor allows for a bigger payload, it allows for a heavy camera uh, to be taken. And you fly that right right right. Right. Now what you see here are carbon fiber legs that actually fold down. So it's, it makes the system itself very easy to carry, um, easy to put away, no inconvenience. As you can see there, we powered arm with the gimbal itself and it's stabilized. Yeah. So with the uh, Phantom 2 Vision range, uh, either the first or the second range, you can download an app on your smartphone, which allows you to control the tilt of the camera allows you to control uh, flight movement right. and as well as see where your Phantom 2 Vision uh, or Vision Plus is flying around. Uh, in each one you can see telemetry, you're allowed, you can see also um, the flight pattern of where you're flying to. You can record directly onto your phone uh, the photos and also the videos there. Uh, all you need is to turn on the receiver itself. So I turn that on. That extends the Wi-Fi range on the smartphone, allowing you to actually receive what the camera is seeing on either the Phantom 2 Vision or the Vision Plus. This not only allows you to control how you're flying without having to worry about flying aside, it allows you to extend and create aerial footage uh, for 
uh, high definition ones. So with, with some people, with, um, when you fly actually, there are issues where um, you may not see the phantom fly and you may actually want to um, make it a little scared, a little jittery and you want to make sure that uh, you don't lose your phantom uh, to version plus. So what we do say is that you turn off the remote, you turn off that remote and what happens is the phantom will learn to come back to the spot that you took off from which is a great tip at all because it means that the phantom knows not to actually just go and stay there or hover, they actually come right back to you um, where you started from first. Now that also remember calibrate uh, the compass and move to the calibration. So let's let's try and do that one. So calis uh, compass calibration. Flash and yellow means it's been calibrated properly. Put that right back down. And so now it means that the Phantom 2 itself, or the Phantom product, is ready to fly with GPS. Now, because we're inside, we're not going to fly that. This is no GPS, but we're going to fly single flight. Let's turn that on. Let's see. Alright, we're going to demonstrate the new Phantom Vision Plus. And here we go.
what's up guys? Lewis here with DJI, bring you the new DJI Ronin. So with this gimbal, you're able to hold up to 16 pounds of payload. So an Epic, a Dragon with your C-Motion pressed in, a wireless transmitters, that's not a problem. There's a toolless uh, balancing design, so we're going to have a knob over here so you can release to make micro increment adjustments, uh, as well as the ability to quick release this system out, and uh, so you can hang this on a copter, which we do not have right now. Uh, there's also a battery over here that can power this system up for about four hours at a time, so it's going to be under $200 for each. Four of them in your kit's going to be okay for a 16-hour day if you can hold this thing for 16 hours. Uh, also, uh, there's three ways of holding this device. Uh, if you want to do like an eye level adjustment, this, this is a follow mode right now. So, you have that controller, the ra radio transmitter, if you want to be able to uh, have a second operator. But we value the single operator mode. Uh, so we have this, and we also have this kind of a this kind of a, a briefcase type of uh, style, so you can. Um, go through doorways a lot easier and uh, so that's one way now all right so now that I reset it's uh, we have the ability to blow to use the second operator so the operator doesn't need to worry about the framing as much it needs to get into the ballpark and the operator uh, the camera operator is going to be able to do all your panning and, and tilting uh, yeah, so it's going to be available for under $5,000 in about a month or so. There you go.